Hello Scorpions, welcome to Daily True Tarot and this reading is for the second half of March. So let's check what are the messages for you. Messages for Scorpions. What you can expect in this second half. Knight of Pentacles. Queen of Cups, King of Pentacles in reverse, Seven of Wands, Nine of Swords. Okay, so here we have Queen of Pentacles, sorry, King of Pentacles in reverse, Scorpions. Looks like you have given someone a good lesson. This person is now realizing that um, you can't be treated like an option. They cannot um, come and go as they please. This could be someone who might have broken their promise a thousand times. Or um, this could be someone who might have ghosted you. And out of nowhere, they will come back. And uh, they would expect you to accept them like nothing ever happened. They would expect you to give them the love you always used to uh, give them. This person would try to make it look like uh, it's not a big deal. If they left you all alone when you needed them, needed them the most or when... Um, you wanted them to be there, they ghosted you, it doesn't mean a lot and um, you still can work on this. So this person is um, going to offer you something, but then I see here Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands is about um, recognizing your strength and uh, finally getting over your weakness. So Scorpions, maybe your love for them became a weakness for you. You might have been ignoring their carelessness, irresponsibility, or their disbehavior for long. Maybe you have ignored a lot of red flags and now it's time to stand for yourself. And this person is also surprised. They feel that um, you have changed. Okay, I see that this person will come back. They would... Um, try to have a nice conversation, they will try to uh, show you the love, they will try to make you believe that they are still into you, but uh, they are aware that this is not going to be easy. You are protecting yourself. If you see this card carefully, this woman has created this barrier with, with those ticks. So this person is um, getting this idea that you are protecting yourself. You're not going to let them harm you. And this is quite uh, surprising for them. Because this is not uh, what they have expected. Also, we have Knight of Pentacles here. Now, this is someone who feels that everything can work. Even if they stay in their comfort zone. This person is not ready to do anything extraordinary for this extraordinary love. And um, they are expecting everything uh, to flow just like that. This person is addicted to your unconditional love. And uh, this has spoiled them too much. This person feels that um, they can take you for granted or they can act like this. And still things will work. Just because you have spoiled them with your love. And... Uh, with this queen of cups this person also knows that you are this queen filled with emotions filled with love you follow your heart and you are just opposed to them they are this king of pentacles and you are this queen of cups so a lot of uh, contrast is here and uh, this person felt that uh, since you are this queen of cups, your emotions will always uh, be your choice and you will act according to your emotions. 
But now this practical person is getting that. That you too can protect yourself. You too can stand for yourself. It's not like your emotions are so strong or intense that you will fall weak. We have this nine of swords here. With this nine of swords, it's about dreams. This person is also being interrupted um, by their dreams. I mean, I see nightmares here. It's not about dreams. It's something that is uh, making them afraid. There are a lot of things that they want to run away from. Seeing you like this is a nightmare. Seeing you uh, so strong is a nightmare. Seeing you protecting yourself is a nightmare for them. And uh, this person will go back to sleep. Okay, looks like... In the second half, this person will come back. They will try to start a conversation without offering any explanation, without giving you any apology. They would expect you to accept them just like that. And when you don't do that, this person will crawl back. They will go back to sleep. Because they feel that time will heal everything. Again, they will assume that um, you will for forget those things over the time. And then they will wake up and deal with it later. That is what their strategy is going to be. However, this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Six of Wands. Eight of Wands in reverse. Nine of Wands. Knight of Cups and Knight of Wands in reverse. So this person never expected to find themselves in this situation. Rejection is not in their dictionary. Okay, this person never got rejected. This could be someone who is highly confident of themselves. Maybe they flirt a lot and they get attention easily. And um, that is why they never had this idea that this could too happen. We have this eight of uh, wands in reverse. Now I see a different story here. With this eight of wands in reverse, this person could be in a relationship with someone. Or maybe they met someone and uh, this friendship was in initial phase looks like this person was um, betrayed by someone or someone has given them a good lesson not only you but others are also giving them a good lesson it's like whoever they meet is actually reflecting them only it's a situation where they have to deal with their own karma and it's coming back through different people they are blaming others but um they are also aware of what they did because with this nine of wands, I see them figuring out what they did, what happened next, who said what to them and why is it all happening. This person is getting into the details. They are very well aware of what's happening in their life. We have this six of wands. With the six of wands, uh, it's about winning uh, in a situation. Certainly this person feels like you are winning over them or you have got some kind of um, um, lead. Like you are on this journey of moving on and you left them behind. You are ahead. You are moving faster and um, you are recovering faster. So a lot is going on. And um, with this Knight of Cups, this person will approach you. They would want to give you this cup they would um, again try to be friends if you don't accept them as a lover immediately then they would try something else they will go back to sleep and then they will come up with an idea they will try to be friends i don't see them going this person will be around you they will keep um crossing your ways crossing your paths so that you do not forget them let's check an oracle message for you.
spirit weaver. So for them, you are the spirit weaver. This person is growing because of you. This person is learning because of you. And uh, their spirit is gaining a lot of strength and knowledge because of you. And that's why they are back here unknowingly. This person needs your energy. There is something about this connection that they cannot define. You are necessary for them to evolve and to be a better person. That's why this person is chasing you. Though they might not know this. Okay. So this was the reading for the second half of March. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Till next video. Bye.